Hello. Welcome back. I have to leave it here for a sec because we're at a nice percent. Welcome. My cinnamon funny Ellerin Radiant Moonshade Seth Dead Zone. So yeah, we're continuing the Mr. Mushroom Room Rando from where we left off. <clears throat> We've gotten the three dreamers. We've gotten Spore Shroom. And I talked to Mr. Mushroom in the first place. So we just need to go, we need to find the second place again. I need to find the third place at all. And then the fourth one's really easy, we can just warp there. Um, and then I think, I think we found five and seven, but I don't know where they are. Six I don't think we found. I'm pretty sure that's the state of this currently. I think that's right, it has been a week, but <laughs> I think I remember. Custard, thanks for the 29. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I'm, I'm zooming. So, I'm going to be honest, chat. I didn't want to wander around for like hours to try and find something I already found. So I did look back at the VOD for the second location. <laughs> Hopefully that's not cheating. Yeah, it's literally right here. It's right next to a bench. I just forgot about it. Crave excitement, thanks for the 30. What is it? Oh, that's Pikachu. I don't really want ASCII art though, because you're going to invite some dangerous things. If I allow that. <laughs> okay, we found the room again. We're back. Get out of my way, B. Let's go. What's up, Mr. Mushy? Shouldn't trust the eye they gave you. Rely on your own instincts. You've got a keen nose, use it. While you're hunting for secrets, you wear those who are hunting you. Oh, excuse me. Alright, that's... Two Mr. Mushrooms. And I haven't even found the third location, so... We're just gonna have to wander around now. Try and find new places. Uh, that's because that's a soul refill. Did I do everything here, or were there like dive floors or something? I mean, I didn't specify which one it was, but we might just get to rending before we even, before it even matters. Okay, we've been up here. Wait, what? What room is this? Okay, it is this room. I'm gonna go back to the tram, because that was new. I'm pretty sure.
This room isn't new, though. I think the other two tram spots haven't been gone to yet. Have I been here? I have been here. Okay. Shortcut to here. I don't know if I care about that. Path of Pain. Oh, I can't do this. This would be so doable if it wasn't for this one little section here. Wait! The soul totem! No way! The soul totem! Oh my god, it's actually doable. I was gonna say, you can't make it up there. But the soul totem was actually... came in clutch. No! Hold on, I need to not use up the soul totem. Or I'm screwed. Don't choke. I choked! Okay, there's still there's still hits. Oh, this is a the saw is a room rando thing. Okay. That's what it is. I knew there was something weird. Oh my god. Right, you don't even need that. But that saw normally isn't there. Dude, that part sucks. Okay, I need to start worrying about my health. Not really. That jump. That's the hard one. We're good. No, dude! Oh my god, I'm so bad. I was just trying to do it with confidence and just fall through. But I like don't, didn't even remember where I was. It's weird doing it backwards. Oh my. Why can't I just do reverse path of pain? It's not that hard. Oh my god, dude, I choked. I didn't I couldn't commit I didn't know what to commit to. Oh, I have full soul. It's fine, because I have King Soul, right? King Soul is giving me infinite attempts, which is nice. So I don't have to worry about losing health here. Just wasting time. Okay, I literally just needed that pogo last time, and we got it. Duplicate cloak. <laughs> well, I definitely wasn't going to find that from the other direction. Oh my god. Shio. Oh. Soul refill. I don't even know how that looks in the painting. But Zord's probably going to show us. My work doesn't move you. Uh, not really. It's hoping for something cooler.
I'd just like to point out how much of a scam this dash pickup was. Because how was I supposed to get here without dash? Is that possible? <laughs> Did I? I thought I was over here already. Oh, I guess I ha I wasn't over here. And here's Shio's hut, which we were just inside. Bench? Back to Path of Pain, or White Palace. It's all connected. Okay, there's a few different ways I can go here. I'm gonna start off with the top exit. So remember to go back to uh, previous bench. Honestly, deserved ban. <laughs> Yo, the collector. Okay, three checks. Might as well do it. Or, you know, four checks. I think. Although, I don't think maps are random, so it is three checks. So I was right the first time. Sup? How about you collect this L? Real quick. Ow. Wait, that's wrong. The command is wrong, it's show, not snow. Whatever. Oh wait, this is no checks. <laughs> this is just grubs. Oh, it was a check. I'll save them. Maybe it'll give me good karma for later. Mask shard. I'm just gonna go back this way. Oh wait, is there something up here? Yeah, this room. Elder who? Remember the elder. I don't think I even need to remember the elder, but I guess I will. I don't think there was anything else for Essence. Is 
there... There's like an egg up here, right? Something. I see it. Shape of Un. Oh my god, the lantern! Yes! Finally. <laughs> no more dark rooms. Okay, I'm glad I remember those two checks there. I'm looking for Mr. Mushroom. Location 3. But you know, if I get like... Like Lantern, that was helpful. Um, I guess I don't really have much else I need to find. Besides Void Heart. So we can over... Over accomplish. Okay, um... I think I know where this is. Ah! Down here. Yeah. Ah, oh, what? I've been here. I've definitely been here. Okay, bottom, bottom left transition. Envin, thanks for the 21. Now this isn't this isn't crazy enough for a top 10 video anymore. Everybody knows about this. Wait, how do I leave? <laughs> there. I feel like I've also been over here, but maybe not. Have I been here? There's a bench. Oh, I should have checked if I had that bench, because I don't even know. Thanks for the luck, Mini. What? Actual... Real locations, kind of. Wait, I've definitely been here. The lever's open. This is where Slug is. Wait, was that actually through this transition? No. Okay. I thought it was. I don't think I've been this way. Wait, I have. I think. I have been here. Was I through this way though? Okay, I've been here too. It's Lupin time. It's the time in the rando where we just loop constantly. And struggle to find new places. Um... I don't think if I have a bench that's like I haven't explored a whole lot. No. Well, it's definitely going to be nice being able to see in the deep nest rooms.
Oh, new. Money. I really don't need money, but why not? What? I missed that? On the real map, I'm pretty close to where I need to be. But that means nothing. I've been here. Yep. Bingo with randomizer? That's a video. Already. I mean, I could do it again, but I just didn't really want to. I think I remember... I was trying to get people to ask, to give me suggestions that involved the rando in some way, and there weren't much suggestions like that. So I got annoyed <laughs> and didn't do it again. What is the name of the rando mod? Randomizer. Randomizer 4. Or is it 5 now? I think it's four. Randomizer five win. I still not fought Hornet too. I haven't. <laughs> you suck. Get fireballs. Oh, room rando bingo. Nah, I'm good. Nobody will pick good goals for that, I already know. That'll be even worse. The problem is if you do a bing if I do a bingo, a rando bingo, and it's like it's the same level of difficulty it normally is, it's gonna take like way too long. Like, you kind of need easier objectives and things that can be more fun for the rando. But people just pick insane ones anyways. What's what's your video idea, Minifish? Is it... Room rando, all settings, dark mod, all bindings... Uh, hitless? Oh, I never found this egg. Wait, have I even been in this room? Oh my god! Okay, true ending unlocked. True ending is unlocked, so I guess we're getting true Mr. Mushroom ending now. I wasn't even sure if I'd go for this, but like, it worked out. Which honestly makes sense because... Mr. Mushroom ending is... has a lot more requirements than the true ending does. I don't think I ever found this room. Or maybe I just didn't go that way. I don't remember. I haven't been here either, so... Randomized settings, I have to guess which ones are on. 
Well, I kind of did do that throughout that one. I was trying to figure it out. It just wasn't a whole challenge at the end. Okay, so checks. I don't really care about checks a whole lot now. I mostly just want new rooms. Because we basically have everything. I have lantern, all skills, all upgraded spells. The only thing I don't have is all nail arts. So I guess that could help. Do I have elevator pass? I'm still missing elevator pass. Okay, there is a couple things then. Have I been to Nosk room yet? Apparently not. Oh, I've been on the other side of this. At some point. I remember thinking it was impossible because I didn't have dash. If I didn't have dash though, maybe there's more over there. Because that was very early on. Oh! This is the White Palace bench. And this is still blocked off. But I've already been on the other side anyways. Guess I never went here. <laughs> that looks so weird. The Dung Room. Wow. I'm surprised that didn't hurt me. <laughs> um, beast den? <laughs> Makes sense. I'm gonna go up here. Wait, no, this is a dive floor, right? I think I get the item. Where the hell's the hopper? I have to go up here to get the hopper to spawn. I can do it. Unbreakable heart. Let me out! <laughs> I'm gonna kill this aspid. Boop. Destroyed. Wait, why did I sit? I mean, I think that actually gets me more items. But I could have just, like, gone up. Dive storage. Isn't that banned? That's good.
That was not the normal devout skip. <laughs> I did get it. Cool totem. Seen a lot of those lately. So yeah, there's a chance that I need to ride an elevator to get to one of the locations I need, so I should definitely keep checking all the checks. Oh cool, another cloak! There's so many cloaks! Way more cloaks than I could ever need. I should be able to dash... Gain an additional aerial dash per cloak. I think that would be fair. Really? <laughs> Trying to look cool. Okay, nothing over here. That's a new way though, I guess I just never went over there. I feel like most of this has been explored already. where Mossy was. Oh, I did this so early on. I remember this. No, I looped back all the way here. Have I even found the upper tram yet? I wonder if that leads anywhere. Dude, I never see that bee. Wow. Oh right, this is where I got jump scared. This is where the elevator is not working. Elevator is the one thing I don't have. Damn it! 
Probably been down here a billion times anyways. Oh, this is left cliffs. Did I get everything here? Why do I feel like I never really went here? Never really explored this room much. Might have went through here. Definitely fought those guys. Ow. Someone let me up. Yo, the turnaround. <laughs> what a friend. Oh right, it's just the grub, what am I doing? I keep checking grub locations as if it's gonna be a check. I should know. I know. I've actually been on the other side of this. But I guess I could open up like a shortcut to wherever that is. Might as well. Big B. Thank you, Bigby. I'll spare you. Oh, this is new. Grubbies. Free all the grubbies. Okay. I don't know if there's any down transitions that are actually useful anymore, so... Maybe should have expected that. I did find the second room, because I looked at the VOD, <laughs> but we're trying to find the third room now, which I've never even stumbled upon yet. It's going to be a left transition, so I should maybe prioritize left transitions. A, that was a weak egg, but <laughs> it's okay. If you want some good eggs, then watch the Cavern of Dream of it. Cavern of Dreams video. That game, I was thinking that game might be my game of the year, because I don't know what else I would pick. Lever? Have I not hit this? Oh my god! Oh my god, this is a location! This is a location, let's go! He's not gonna be here yet, but... It's here. We need to, we need to get a traceable path back here. This is... 
the sixth location. Okay, uh, yeah, I need to find a path here from a bench. Because it's going to be a while before I need to go here. Uh, okay. I have been here. Is there a bench nearby? That's not a bench. I got really annoyed by that. <laughs> that hit there. Recall the rule. Yeah, I keep thinking of Outer Wilds when I say the sixth location or whatever. I forgot which one it was though. I forgot which number. Dude, what? Hallways. Wait, it's left from here? Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna... Okay, you guys are... Yeah. I'm gonna try going the other path. I'm looking for location 3, which is Galeon's room. Currently, I'm looking for a path from here to a bench so I can remember how to get here. There's no benches near this thing, dude. Oh, come on. Have I been through here? Let me just go through here. Not sure if I even went through here. Ow. I have. Wait. Okay, we found a path. Okay. It's from here. Let me get a uh, notepad. So what even bent? This is atrium, I believe. Atrium. Atrium. Down left. I know I could just use map mod, but it'd be nice to not have to use it. Down. It's through all the white palace rooms. Let me go right. And now I have to do this in reverse. It's actually pretty easy. Right, right. Down left. Okay. Easy path. We'll be able to find that easy. Recall the route of the sixth location.
There, the best way to get out. Dude, I have <laughs> Sprint Master. <laughs> This is the worst spot to have Sprint Master because I always walk too far. Ugh. I know I've been over here too, I just... I can't do it! Oh my god. Thank you. It's just the extra speed from walking makes that impossible. Wait, this just goes here? <laughs> There's no point. Have I been to every stag I have yet? I'll take it. I don't know why I took it. I just lost the money for no reason. I'm taking your whole stock of money. I'm rich. God damn it, this is just hive bench. Yes, that's the perfect spot to see dash. Silk song out. What silk song? That's where Sly was. Oh, and we're back at the start. the best cope is to pretend that Silk Song isn't even real. And then you're not disappointed about no news. What? Oh, <laughs> I was like, where even am I? I think I made it through this in the dark. gets me anything really. GTA 6 before Silk Song. Yeah, we might get we might get the game before Silk Song too. I think the main thing with Silk Song is that like we literally had demo footage of the game like in 2020 and it looked like really good and then just no news for like three years. Like that's why it was weird because it looked like it was coming along really well. I was like oh shit that looks like it's almost done. And then it was like Radio silence. Which I don't I don't feel like I've experienced that with the game before.
usually don't get the get like a polished looking demo three years before any release date. I don't know where to go. I feel like I've been everywhere. Made the game too big. 100 hour playthrough incoming. Listen, it's just more content if it's if it's an insanely big game. If I broke through the floor here, I did. Maybe I didn't go up this way though? Because I was breaking through the floor? Now nah, I've been here. Oh my gosh, have I not been here? I feel like I haven't been here. And it's not going to get me the transition, but there's a couple items. Grub song. Elevator pass? The legendary artifact? Nope. <laughs> Duplicate king soul. Well, now this is open. Wait, was this always open? I think it was always open. Yeah, I remember my first playthrough was pretty long. I don't remember the exact hour count, but... It's like, I got a lot of playtime out of this even before God Home DLC. <laughs> None of this is really useful at all. Yeah, I guess I should just be going through the left transitions. I'm also just trying to like find places I haven't been though. Which don't necessarily need to be left, but if I'm somewhere I have been left is probably a good idea. Unless I'm here and I remember being to the left of this earlier. Wait, I was just here. Um, just gonna keep picking new benches. Hey, Black Egg Temple. Hey, I was literally just here. Wow. I definitely did this, and I remember doing the entire cutscene for a solo refill. Even uh, when I released my demo for Lost Call, people played it a surprisingly amount of time. Just because I think people are getting, like, lost. Like, it's kind of interesting how you don't really need that big of a map as long as it has, like, a lot of different connections. There's, like, it takes people a long time to explore. Made you play Cavern of Dreams. Nice. 
That game, it's such a good game. I was like, I wanted to edit that because I'm like, I want to relive the game. There, sometimes I'll play a game and I'm like, I want to edit my playthrough so I, I can like relive it. Like I wanted to edit Sniff because of that. There's just, there's a lot of subtle things in that, that game did that were like amazing. One thing I really like is uh, the story, the lore. I I love how the game does lore because there's not just like text dumps. Like I've played so many games this year that are just like, the lore is just a wall of text that you find. And it's like, I can't, I'm just not interested in it. That's not all oh right because I don't have lore turned on. Uh, have I been through here? I didn't have lantern. Wait, this might be new. Was lantern hiding the third location? Not decisive yet. I think I have actually been on the other side of this lever, by the way. This might have just been for a crab. Yeah, this is the first location. Just the other side. Damn it. Loop. Uh, what I was going to say is... The way that game does lore is like... Oh my god, I've never been here? Okay. The way that game does lore is it has these cards that are like collectible cards. And they're of all the characters that you like find throughout the game, but they just give a little bit more detail about the characters. And there's also like some environmental storytelling. It's, it's just really, it's done in a really cool way. Maybe, I don't know if it's something that I care to not spoil. But there's like, you know, it actually really interested me without, with, about the characters and stuff in a very subtle way. It's probably like my favorite way I've seen lore in a game. Yeah, Cavern of Dreams. Because there was literally like world building just in the collectible cards and the environment and stuff that actually had impact on the story as a whole, because there's like the Frozen King thing. What happened to the Frozen King directly impacted the main villain and like why they, they're doing what they're doing. So like all the environmental like things that happened, like the box that you find. The reason that like the queen was frozen and stuff, like it all had an impact on the story. It was like so interesting, and it all ties together into the characters that are actually in the story currently, and like it it explains their backstories. It was like really cool, and maybe that's you know that that game. The main thing of that game wasn't the lore, but I just thought it was really fascinating the way they did it, and like you'll be in a room, right? There's a part in that game where like you're in this room where like time is frozen and your character just has like a sad face and it's like it's such a subtle thing. It's like my character is sad in this room because of like what happened. It's just really interesting. I'm probably not explaining it super well, but I just found it really well done. Have I? I don't think I ever went down here, right? Like the dive thing. This is uh, fungal core. Other room. It's 
Can we keep going down? Okay! <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> Yeah, talking about cavern of dreams. Cozy thinks about thirty six. I can almost reach you, Grab. Like, I wouldn't say play that game for the lore, but it was just really cool to me. Because I've just been playing all these games this year that are like, I just don't care about the lore. <laughs> I can't be bothered. Oh. I think when I got here last, I didn't have Swim or Sea Dash. So this has potential here. Oh, that is the big three years. I'm bad at math. I should have known by the cloth noise, though. <laughs> I'm just finding grubs! <laughs> I've been finding so many grubs lately. Yeah, we found Grubfather. There's nothing else there for me. It's like no reason to get grubs. Adding to the plot instead of the plot being based around the story. Wait. Oh yeah, I guess... I don't know. <laughs> I feel like that's worded weird. I want more games like that do lore like that because... That got me. I didn't need to, like, watch an hour-long Lore Explained video. I didn't need to, like, read mountains of text. For me, personally, I like that kind of lore. It's like... Honestly, in a way, it was kind of like similar to the whole, you know, Hollow Knight, Rain World, Dark Souls kind of lore, where you you find out about the lore just by like item descriptions or like little things you find throughout the world, but in a more like subtle way. Because I feel like Rain World, Hollow Knight and stuff, I can't really figure out the lore myself very well. I guess Rain World you can if you collect every single pearl. But I never did that. <laughs> I didn't really want to. It was just too much of too much effort that I didn't want to go through. But I never picked this up. I feel like I've been here. Or wait, is this a soul refill? Oh no, it's not. I just never got that. Never got this either. Oh. I do think like Hollow Knight and Rain World lore is really cool, but it's not something I really figure out myself while playing through a whole lot. I got like the gist of it. But... I guess these are also much deeper lores, so that's kind of why they need to be explained for me. There's just a lot going on. And honestly, I find the Rain World lore super interesting. It's such a like unique world. It, it makes me wonder like how they came up with all that stuff. <laughs> I've been, I feel like I've been in this room like 10 times today. Oh, 
Oh, we're back here. Have I been on the other side? I can get up here now. Can I play Little Nightmares? Yeah, let me just uh, play Little Nightmares. Little Nightmares 2, upload both, edit both playthroughs, and put them up on my channel. Oh, they're already there! YouTube.com slash scurry. Oh, frick. I... I'm looping a lot. <laughs> this always happens at, after a certain point of room randos, where you have enough of the map and you have like all the abilities, to the point where it's like I can't find that one little area I haven't been, and you just go to the same places over and over. And we've reached that point. Cool shortcut. YouTube speedrun. Chat, I posted on Twitter and my Discord, but I was so close to getting double watermelon <laughs> in Suica. You have no idea, it was the like god setup. I threw it though. Couldn't be done. I had watermelon, melon, and watermelon, melon in the bottom right, pineapple above the melon. All I had to do was get two pears, two peaches, and it was literally done. And then, uh, I got two pears, they barely didn't touch. Two apples, which were not touching, and then I just threw, because they, at that point, there was no space to work with. It was insane. I got 3560, I think. Which I, like, have not seen people get that score, so... Apart from, like, the person I saw get double melon. Double watermelon. I don't like see, like, has anyone seen a streamer get double watermelon? I'm genuinely curious. Because I, <laughs> I was trying to find double watermelon footage and it's like hard to find. Like the only videos I've seen are like of Japanese players. I've seen like two videos from Japanese players who have it. It's like impossible to find. I know, I think Ludwig grinded for like a crazy amount of time and never got it. And probably some other streamers too. But I was like, <laughs> my heart was racing from Suica. <laughs> so stupid. It almost makes me want to like try and grind it out, but like I know I'm probably not going to get that set up again. That was like so lucky. I I record I, after I got like <laughs> the perfect setup. I started recording, so the footage of the whole thing doesn't exist, but the footage of me throwing exists. Honestly, it's not even really throwing. I just I got screwed, kind of. It was, I don't think I could have saved it ever.
think pl I think running watermelon percent got me like goaded at the game. <laughs> Top top ten watermelon percent speedrunner by the way. It's my new calling. I'm gonna get double watermelon and water watermelon percent world record. Why am I here again? <laughs> I was just here. Did I ever go in the lighthouse transition? I feel like I didn't. I guess I came out of it. <laughs> No, I've been on both sides. I've been on left and right at some point. I think because I found that stag and got there. I I was just here too. I need to get out of this this loop I'm in right now. I need to find a bench on the outskirts of here. Leave me somewhere new. Wish I had this open. I haven't been over here. Oh right, this is the stash. Chat, you want to see my Suica run? <laughs> the footage that I do have? So, as you can see, I got the god set up. I got the pineapple, melon, watermelon. It was like all laid out for me. I don't have the footage of me getting that, but there were many miracles. So here's how I threw. I'm like not sure if that was a good choice to get the apple up there, but you'll see. I actually do manage to get the pear there, which is godlike. I'm trying to stop it from pushing to the right here, and it pushes it to the right, which is tragic. Because that's now like so far away, and I need to make the pear touch the other pear. Here I'm like, I don't know what to do with this, so I'm just going to drop it in. And I'm like panicking. I managed to kind of make it work, but that apple's in a bad spot. Here is where it all goes to shit. You'll see those don't touch. I try to push it. It actually does push a decent amount, then it stops. I try to keep pushing it and it falls down. And that's where the entire thing is thrown because at this point, I never get them to touch. And I really needed them to. And it's like, it was so close. And now I'm just like, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I went for that. I was trying to roll it down. Somehow didn't get me out. And then, yeah. At this point, it's like, can't really do anything. Like all I needed was those those pairs to touch, dude. That's all I needed. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> it would have been really hard to make another one.
But yeah, tragic. Is the music stuck in your head? I don't play with the music, I hate the music. Drives me insane. <laughs> I was like, I don't know, I had a stream on or something. Or a VOD. Send Artie. I never tried because I didn't want to. <laughs> uh, I actually can't fall asleep with music. I remember in college, um, when I was on residence, I was just human. Sometimes my, the person right next to me would like be super loud at like 3, 4 a.m. And I would uh, try to like drown it out with music. And I just could not fall asleep at all. And I'd listen to like really gentle like ambient tracks and it, I would still not fall asleep. I just can't. I don't know what it is. Please shout me out. <laughs> Probably shouldn't go to like streamers and ask to be shout out. Left side of dirt mouth, yeah, I've tried that. No, not here again. Yeah, maybe the elevator is the key. <laughs> maybe I need the elevator pass. But where is the elevator pass? Uh, I've, I've been doing it currently without using that Colette. The only thing I did currently was um, I looked at the VOD <laughs> to find where something was. But it's mostly just been memory and I did take a couple notes. Or I took one note for one thing to find later. I like to resort to that when I'm like stuck. But I try to go without it. So I can kind of test my memory skills and stuff. What is my- my longest rando was God Home Ending Room rando, which is close to 12, I think? I don't think I've done one more than 12 hours. Unless you count the Zelda randos, which are easily over 20 sometimes. <laughs> OOT was like 20, 21 hours? 22 hours? Maybe 3? I think it was like 20, it was like 22 or 23. Twilight Princess was like 20 to 21. Wow, I never broke this. I was just in this room. The other Zeldas weren't as bad. Those were the two worst ones.
left in tram. Yeah, I did that. I went to all the transitions from lower tram. Like at the start of stream. You know, it's a really good video that I watched recently. I posted it in the Discord. Um, it was like on the game design around Mario Maker troll levels, and it was like a three hour video. And I thought it was really good. Would recommend. It like went super in depth into like the game design theory and stuff of, around it. And there's also just like these crazy things that you can do in that game that I didn't know about. I mean, I watch a decent amount of Mario Maker content because I think it's cool, but... Oh my god! Upper Tram? Upper Tram. I haven't been here. Chances this leads me somewhere new? Let's see. No, it's just a dead end. <laughs> it's just a dead end. Really, it's a dead end with a bench with nothing here. It's the sneaky grass room. Screw you, sneaky grass. Well, so much for upper tram. That was not the key to anything. Yeah, I, I accidentally left maps off because I had on like default settings. And then I think I turned on like soul totems or whatever. What is it? There's like a, there's a setting that's like totems and stuff. It might just be soul totems. But I accidentally left off grubs and maps, which I usually turn on, but I always forget they're not default. I thought those were just default settings. That big thanks for the 37. Did I go through left here? I never fought these guys. Oh, it's just a grub. Well, it's good to find new stuff anyways, just to rule that out. Wait, what? <laughs> this was already open. <laughs> Wasn't it? Oh wait, did I come from the top? Oh, I haven't been here! I haven't been to this bench! Look. Breda bench is not here. This is new. I could have been here though, because I've been here. Okay, make sure I pick all this shit up, because I keep being in this room and not picking everything up. Okay, <laughs> there's nothing.
Money. I definitely need more money. I don't have enough. Oh? Elevator pass from, uh... Hail Lurker? Uh, sound warning. Okay, nothing in the other items. Time for my favorite fight. Yay, they teleported after one hit. So fun. Yay, they teleport after one hit. I feel like I've been finding so much new things, and they just lead to disappointment. Where did I leave my dream gate? Did I leave it somewhere? I wanted to check more things. I can check more things here. I think there's one more. Came from there. Go up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's still in room six. Uh oh. Hoping I left it somewhere better. Room and Mr. Mushroom. I'm trying to get Mr. Mushroom ending. So we need to find all the Mr. Mushroom locations. Which is all we need to do at this point, because I've already got everything else I need. We're looking for the third location. The Galleon Room. Back here again. I'm in a crazy loop right now. The Bread of Bench did not help me much. Maybe go back to how I got here. I always mistake that for. Uh, I don't know. This room, right. There might be another transition here I didn't do. What? room is this? <laughs> oh, it's the long tunnel. Hold on, I want to like... Can I get back up? I kind of want to go back to this room. Oh, confirmed, haven't been this way. Oh, it's hot springs. <laughs> I'm stupid.
There's, I forgot there's no transition there. I feel like I've went through the other transitions here. Like this one. Definitely this one. Far right. The only way to get through this one. And we're back. I feel like we have seen every water room's waterways room. Or most of them. There's not a whole lot of waterways rooms. There's just they're just big. Elevator, stop taunting me. It's like the only thing I can't do right now is ride the elevator. It's all I want. I was like just through here too. That's Menderbug's house, right? That's this? Did it ever go this way? Yes. I've also, I never found Broken Vessel, but <laughs> I've found this transition before. No, this is just here. <laughs> I'm actually I'm gonna go insane because <laughs> I can't. I can't find anywhere new. It's all it's the same rooms over and over again in an endless loop, an endless cycle. Codex taken. Thanks for the prime. Marmu room. Have I fully explored this area? Because it is a dark room. Oh, it's this room again. I was just here. Have I even found like the big deep nest dark room? I don't think I have.
elevator duped. Uh, is it? Does it count as a major item? I don't even know. Dude, I was just here too. I don't know, I'm taking like entirely different routes from different benches. And I still end up in the same places. Oh, <laughs> the grave, yay. Now we can do flower quest for its soul refill. I'm gonna put this here. I feel like I haven't been in this area for a while. Oh, it's just over here. Okay, well, I've been here a lot. Let me check out this canyon room. Oh? Wait. New? New? New. So we got some items, and we got a transition on the right. Going back for the grub. Ah. Okay. This is not good, because this doesn't lead anywhere. And I've already been up the elevator, so it doesn't help me in any way. Rip. Thought I was getting somewhere. I guess I did get like three checks. Wait, there's another check, right? Top, top left. here. Never went in there, though. I'm pretty sure I did this. I just want to make sure. Stop bumping into every guy. Honestly, this isn't that far from the grave, but it's an egg. Or is it far? I don't even remember. I felt like I had seen it recently, but I don't know if I like warped or something. Damn it. That was a new check, but... Might as well have not been.
did find some new stuff at least. That's nice. It's better than just looping constantly. Something was near here. Something important was near here. I don't remember what it was though. Have I done this? <laughs> I just keep getting totemed. No, not again. Not this room again. Uh, well, I died a lot early on. I haven't died this stream at all. I don't think I've even fought a boss. Archives. Already did archives. I want to find somewhere that has rooms I haven't just been going through ever, like 50 times. I feel like I haven't been in this bigger room, but I've been in that room like three times. Okay, I've definitely been here many, many a time. So that looped very quickly. this already. Oh, this is the Lem room. Yeah, I should have known this was going to go this way. Like, it was going to really slow down after a certain point. In terms of finding things. I have so many crafts. Oh my god. Thanks for dream shields. And 20k. Well, I might as well get whatever the hell's in the fountain, right? At this point, I don't even think I have any use for that whatsoever. Twenty-three. Lucifus, thanks for the prime.
Oh, chat, the crazy uh, turn of events. I've actually done lamp skip before. It was in the flower quest room rando. I already did it. Someone commented on it. They're like, lamp skip. And I'm like, wait, lamp skip? What do you mean? So I clicked on it, on the timestamp. And it was the exact skip I did during this one. I already had done that skip, I just forgot about it. And it's funny because I kept like... I was like, no, the lamp doesn't work, it's not gonna work. And that was, like, last time I probably just did it right away. I didn't pick up the key. Well, what? I th you have to pick it up. <laughs> There's literally no reason to have a key anyways. I shouldn't have even spent my money. transition. <laughs> I don't know where to go at this point. I might need to, I might start using the map soon. The map mod. I think it is it installed by default? The like room rando thing? Cause I have map mod S on or whatever it's called. Rando map mod. Is it a separate thing for the room rando? Okay. Yeah, might start using it. <laughs> Just to find uh, rooms I haven't gone through yet. So at this point I am losing my mind. Didn't I struggle up there? Did I ever do this? I think I came from the other direction. I think I came from here once. Yeah, this is King's Pass. How do I use it? <laughs> Mode? Well, I don't know what this is doing. Transition normal, is this it? Why is there so much blank though? Dude, I don't know what's going on with stream elements. <laughs> I don't know why it's in my chat. I need to like figure out why that's going on. I used stream elements once because I wanted it during the charity stream and then I uh because I thought it was the only way to get donation sounds, but apparently Streamlabs had it the whole time. There just was no setting for it. But now it's just kind of here, <laughs> I guess. 
Oh, so light gray rooms are the ones that I haven't gone through yet. Okay. Jeez. That means every dark room, I've already been through everything. Why is dirt mouth? Unchecked, right one. Right one. What's right one? Dirt mouth? I missed the dirt mouth one? Elevator. That would make sense. Yeah, I've never been up here. Well. <laughs> are these checks, though? I think these are checks. Oh. Oh, I already had strength on. Why didn't that work? I guess I have to talk again. <laughs> it's, it takes a while to get here. You gotta ride the whole elevator. No. And then every time... I, got, I need to do this three times. Right, going back up. Are you serious? It better not be three egg. Don't be three egg. Whoa! <laughs> How did I time that so perfectly? <laughs> okay, this one was lifeblood mass. It wasn't three egg. It's even worse. Heck on. Yeah, there was nothing at egg shop, I'm pretty sure. Or there was like one thing and I got it or something. Waterways 02, unchecked bottom 2. Okay. There's another bench room I haven't checked today. It's waterways. One of the bottom transitions. The right one. Not this way. Totem for me, thank you. My favorite. Yo! Elevator pass? Not egg! Why am I getting so much egg? Dun 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 Gotcha. All 
I'm not buying it. Any other bench rooms? Where I'm like missing something. Wait. Oh, I don't even. When did I find this room and never go across it? The quantum grass room. I think I didn't have. I was missing something. Quantum grass room has an unchecked uh, transition and the bench. I never even went to it. Deepness 35. Wait, fungus three forty four. Wait, I never went through the bottom. There's no way I never went through the bottom. Wait, really? Well, I have the route here, so let's go there. I'm surprised I never went through the bottom there. That's atrium bottom left through like three white palace rooms and then we go right. Ow, my face. What am I doing? That's a receipt ash. No. No, I'm impatient. I thought I could make it. Apparently I never went through the bottom transition here, somehow. Despite going down here and opening up the lever, that's probably why I never went down. Oh, it's just here. Okay. It's just a shortcut loop. Cut. I guess I finally saved that grubby though after walking past it like a billion times. Oh, here. Where is this? I need compass. <laughs> I need to. Put... Do I have compass? It's three notches. <laughs> it is. It's this. It's this room. Okay, no. Oh, it's green. Okay, never mind. I don't need compass. I thought it was this room for a sec. Wait, that room? I'm missing one. I was just there recently. I didn't check one of the right transitions. Well, if I find that again, take note of that. Ah! Really? <laughs> what about this room?
Wait a sec. Unchecked two? Right two, right one. I haven't been in either of the right transitions here. Are you kidding me? Neither of them. I just went up the elevator and never came back. Alright. Oh, it's Nosk! Hey, you! You stole my scarf! Oh, where'd your scarf go? Seems to have disappeared. Oh yeah, someone was also saying if I died uh, at this point in the rando, I'm not going to die because I'm super OP. That's kind of just how these go. Especially when you get really good notch costs, <laughs> which I did, because I have a uh... <laughs> Twister, Quick Slash, Shaman Stone, Fragile Strength, all at once. Okay, another place I haven't been, down here. Wait, I feel like I've been in this room, though. Have I? Golden Pizza, yay, thanks for the five months. I think I've been here and I just went only in the top transitions. Now I've been through them all. Oh no, not again. The top exit here is still locked. I have King's Brand, but I need to find it from the other side. So it kind of doesn't matter. But there is one transition I haven't been through here, which is the top right. Never mind, I've been to the top right. I just didn't have King's Brand, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, I'm using the cheat sheet. <laughs> Bench Quarrel, Ruins 1 top. Ruins 2 left. Door, Ruin House. We need to get back here. Cheating. <laughs> hey, I, I, I got a lot done without ever using the map. At this point, I'm using it because I'm going insane. Ah! Can you not squeeze through that one? Ruin door, ruin house. I think that's this one. I don't know what house it is. It is this one, okay. So I've never been to the right side of this. We never got this bench. Is it even worth getting the bench? I got it already. So either way, <laughs> it's here. Watch this just be a dead end with nothing in it. 
Oh, it's not. Kill Soul Master. <laughs> Joni's blessing. Yo, new stuff. Hold on, I want to kill Soul Master. This one doesn't work. Got him. <laughs> Get wrecked. Well, <laughs> we know that's not useful. You can upslash, but it's like not even close. It's not even close to having your collision through it. How does that even work? I guess his collision just goes through the floor of it. Oh my god, yes! Yes! Elevator pass. <laughs> Who knows if this is what I needed or not, but... I finally found it. If only I remembered where the elevators were. Right, this is just the rocks. I feel like I've been here. I have. I visited every room here. Our chat, anyone remember where the elevators were? <laughs> I kept finding them today, and now that I have the pass, I'm probably not going to find them. Bravo! No, not here. Left, left, up, right. Okay, left. Left. Up. Damn it. There's no up. <laughs> I know, I was gonna see if it worked. Oh, this is Markov. Markiplier. Haven't visited the butt. I guess they never did. Got more important things to do. Like go through this room for the eighth time. But the thing is, if I go through rooms I've been going through, I might find the elevators, because I've been finding the elevators constantly. 
So it's, it might be a good thing that I'm going through the same rooms again. I might just resort to using the map again. <laughs> I don't want to rely on it too hard, but... I'll, I'll look around for a bit. the bits your cat I feel like there were so many entrances to that tall elevator room that I'm surprised I haven't found it yet or like remember <laughs> where it was at all wow the sideways slash Oh god. <laughs> Don't really want to go that way. I remember doing that and it not being worth it all. And we're back here again. At this point, my brain is just failing me to remember anything. I don't know if I'll be able to find the elevator on my own. Okay, map time. So... the elevator room? This one. Atrium Palace Grounds Left. That's so easy. But like, there's so much going on. I understand why I didn't remember that. Okay, elevator. <laughs> now, I may have already been up here to both of these areas, right? I've definitely been here. Have I been here? Yes. Okay, neither of those were new. So that elevator was pointless. Hi, JX. Astro, thanks for the 28. I already visited all these. Okay, then where's the other elevator? That's, uh...
your city storerooms. Yeah. This one's actually hard to find. Although I was just at Pleasure House like 50 times. So I must have been somewhat close. Dude, I feel I was just here like so many times. We oh. Okay. Other elevator. Have I been on the left side of this? Yes. Have I been down here though? Wait, I I think I have. I think I have been down here. I, I feel like I remember seeing this bell. Oh no. Were both elevators completely pointless? Was I hyping up the elevator pass for no reason? I was. The elevator pass was completely pointless. This is like near the start of the whole run. Okay, let's just start clearing out these rooms where I'm missing stuff. I feel like it's probably not super interesting at this point to uh, just wander endlessly. I don't know. I don't know what house this is. Door Ruin House 3. Okay. Wait, what room didn't I go through here? Yeah. Top? Oh. Wait, but I've been here. I never jumped down, I guess. I remember going past here and never jumping down, but I don't think there's any good down transitions left. It's probably just going to be like... Yeah. Maybe I did jump down. I feel like I've already fall fallen down here. <laughs> so I guess I just didn't go through that one transition. Yeah. Yeah, let me know if I, you think I'm relying too much on the map, because I don't know. I just feel like wandering around is kind of getting boring. Okay, there's something new in this room. Did I miss the top transition here? Definitely not that one. 
Maybe top right. Is this even the room I was looking for? <laughs> it's the bottom one. Your cat, thanks for the bits. Out of the way, dude. Ah, oh, it's just the way back here where I've already been. Most people seem to not mind. Wait, what's top one? There's... I guess that's to the right here. I mean, at this point, where I've already found like all the items without using the map, and we're just trying to find like specific locations, it's like, yeah. I think it's fair, because I, I found basically everything I needed without using the map. And now it's just like, there's so few new places to go that uh, I feel like it's kind of necessary. Ow! <laughs> I'm trying to read the map, buddy. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I feel like I never went through here earlier because I'm like, I don't want to deal with the arena, right? And I don't think I even had like dash at this point. So I feel like this is new. Even though I think the other transition was the one I'm missing. Just, I'm not sure if I had maybe found the other side of this at some point. I feel like I haven't. I don't think I've ever went the other way through this transition here. Oh? Okay, we found Broken Vessel. <laughs> that doesn't really do a whole lot for me. Because... I've already been on the left side of this, but I guess it's interesting. I guess I'll beat this guy up. Yeah, I've already been jailed on the left side. Might as well open up. It's a shortcut that I'll definitely know how to use optimally. I'm free from another jail. Okay, we're going back. Because I think the other top transition down here I also haven't been through. No, I've been here. I thought I was getting led here by the map. Weird. Is 
is this bottom one. Essence is not random, which is why I'm not going for Lost Skin. I did drop all the Geo in the fountain, and I think I left the key there. <laughs> I think I just left it there. Oh, okay, well here's another shortcut. I don't want these shortcuts though. These don't really do anything for me. That's not finding me anything new, that's just a shortcut to somewhere I've already been. I want new things. Damn it. This is definitely not new here. Hey, the start of the game. <laughs> Alright everyone, I'm going on break for a bit. Then we're going to find this freaking third location that is evading me for so long. BRB. Hello.
What does blue mean? <laughs> I don't remember blue. Blue rooms. See that hopper just give up? Not trying to jump at me. I remember going here at the start. How nostalgic. <laughs> They're adjacent? Oh, really? Palace entrance, best bench. Lamp skip bench. Five pebble skin. That is an amazing skin. Did you see the five pebbles plush? <laughs> there's there's five pebbles in moon plush now. And rivulet. And like there's they released like a shit ton of rain world plushes. I don't know if I'm getting any of them because I just got Lizar. And Green Lizard is my favorite, anyways. Though I am temp somewhat tempted to get a third Rain World Plush and get Rivulet. <laughs> Just have like half of my plushes be Rain World Plushes. Probably pass though, just because I already I just bought Green Lizard. Did I never hit that? Okay, cool. <laughs> I walked past that like ten times. Bench. Okay, right. I was I was supposed to be looking for stuff. I got sidetracked because I was thinking about Rain Road plushes. They kind of they kind of change how the skugs look, right? Like the old Rainworld plush looks a bit different than the new ones. Bottom. Hey Taco. I will say though that the. Uh, the lizards are pretty washed out because they're like glow in the dark. I know people. Some people were like, "What? It's that bright looking?" Like, I don't mind, but it's a very light, white out, whited out green color. What mask maker? No, I don't care about mask maker. That it's actually it's kind of funny that transition is the one I need to go through in real life. But clearly not here. I 
I'm very far along in the rando because uh, I've already found everything I need. I just need to find like two rooms. Or is it one room? I think it's one room at this point that I haven't found, right? Did I find every room now? I'm pretty sure I found Abyss 21. So I, it's literally just Deep Nest 40. That's all we need. And then I need to like rediscover these other rooms, basically. Deep Nest 40 is just trolling me. Yeah, we're going for Mr. Mushroom. It's the last main ending thing I haven't done in Room Rando. Besides, like, the flower endings, I guess, but that would be stupid. <laughs> this is more interesting because there's, like, a list of objectives I needed. done with room randos. I mean, I didn't do a room rando for like a whole year until I did this. I think my problem with room randos is just like, it's this state of the run, right? It's, it's really fun at first because you get to do a bunch of skips and stuff. But after you have everything, it's like, it just becomes this like, constant looping, annoying map that you can't like find your way around anywhere you want to go. So there's like this turning point where it just becomes like, unfun. Did I ever go up here? I think I never went down here. Yeah, that's not even broken. That wood plank's not even broken. Oh, there's even an item in here, but I don't really care about items. Ah! Isn't there a totem in this room? I thought there was. Wait, am I wrong? Is there no totem in this room? Why did I think there was a totem? Oh my god, please, I'm gonna actually die. Ugh. Oh, I did. I was right. I thought I was at the bottom of the room already. King's Station Stag? Wait a sec, have I ever been there? Is that new? That's a left tran- that's a new left transition. There's no way, right? There's no way. That would be insane if that's the room I need. We're checking, we're checking. Yeah, I I thought I didn't need any more items. I was wrong. I see so. Wait, there's a prediction for this? <laughs> okay. I guess I'll wait for a bit. I'll just hang out with Tisa. Actually, I don't know until I go through the the wall, the transition.
So that was the final stag. So now, guaranteed, there's no items I need. But this might be it. Could this be the transition I was looking for the whole time? No! <laughs> what is this? No! <laughs> it would have been so fitting. Oh, this is pointless. It felt like it was all lead in there. But I guess I just got trolled again. Isn't Stagnust also new now? This is also new. Dash slash! <laughs> oh right, I can still get the three nail arts, I guess. Maybe this somehow leads to it, and I did need the last stag. Nope! <laughs> no. Fine, I'll slug in the tub. Well, I guess I'll snail in the tub. Free dial, thanks for the the gifts. Well, the the stags were a red herring, it seems. I guess I just got to keep finding new places I haven't been yet. It really felt like that was going to lead somewhere, but I guess not. <laughs> yeah, there was like build up there. But of course, the randomizer doesn't care about that at all. The randomizer just places things with no regard for storyline or impact. What? I was just here. <laughs> it's leading me back here. So there actually there's a room here I never went through. My guess it's probably... Uh, no, I think I went this way. Maybe not? Have I not been here? This might be new. If it's new, it's two left transitions. Oh my god! No, I got scammed! I thought it was it! I actually thought it was it! <laughs> it's like a similar entrance. It's like, it's pretty similar. <laughs> I thought it was it. No, if it was it, it would have the mushrooms. It would have the silly mushrooms. You know, like the, the glow shrooms. Ah. This is just Traitor Lord. Wait, it's another left transition! It's another left transition after Traitor Lord. This could still be it. This is like the mother load of left transitions. This is where it has to be.
Ow, my face. Alright, come on, Trader Lord. You were guarding it the whole time, right? You had to be. No, those aren't glow shrooms. There's another left! There's another left! Keep going! Don't give up! Don't give up hope! No! <laughs> Heavy blow! Dude, it's baiting me so hard right now. The rando is baiting me right now. It's like, oh, you want like four new left transitions in a row? Into heavy blow? God damn it. I thought it was getting somewhere. Okay, just gonna keep looking. Where's Hive? Here. I don't think I, I like never warp here normally unless it's a room rando, so. <laughs> I don't even know where this bench is on the map. Right, okay, so I apparently never went through one of these rooms. I don't know if it's this one or the bottom one. Oh, this is just a hornet too. Well, we're finding all the bosses I left behind. I might as well just beat everyone up. Just for fun. I'm still not finding the room I need though. At least I'm breaking all the jails. Which sadly are kind of pointless to break through because I've already been on both sides now. the bosses are super easy at this point. Get slugged on. Yep. <laughs> Just do god home ending instead. Yeah, I wonder how much bosses I'm missing for that. I mean, I, I purposely didn't do a couple. What did I miss here? Down? Oh my god, I've never been here. But it just loops. It's another shortcut, basically to somewhere I have been, so it doesn't really... It just gets me two pointless checks. And then we loop. Yet again. I'm gonna find like every room before I find this one room I need. I mean, it could happen theoretically. Could theoretically be the final room I find. Worst rando in this game it was probably God Home Ending Room Rando, but OOT Rando is the worst one in any game. <laughs> I think it helps in other. It helps in this game that I have such so much game knowledge that I'm not gonna like completely forget about a check most most of the time. And it has really good. This game has really good like mapping tools and stuff to help you find things. 
So like Zelda games, I have less knowledge and a lot of the times the trackers are not as helpful, so. Hollow Knight renders are never too terrible if you use the tools that you have available, the modded tools. If I had to do a room rando without any help, then it like gets pretty bad, but like anything beyond I've done room randos. I think true ending and normal ending I did without this map tool. But when you need to like get a ton of specific rooms like this or god home ending, it's kinda I feel like it's almost required unless you're you're taking a lot of notes and I don't know. You're insane. I forgot where I was going because I went started ranting about stuff. Like I feel like it's not too bad to find items you need and then Black Egg Temple without using the map mode. But Finding like six specific rooms is kind of rough, or seven specific rooms, especially when one doesn't want to freaking exist. Uh, wait, what left transition have I not been through here? What the hell? Did I never go through the bottom left? That's like crazy to me. Because I've been here so many times. No, I've been here like a billion times. What is it? What is it saying right now? Left, unchecked left two. Huh? What are you talking about? There's a middle? Oh, there is a middle. <laughs> I'm stupid. <laughs> Why did I forget there was one here? This is it, chat. This is the transition. No! This is just Soul Master who's already dead. <laughs> You're already dead. Wait, it's another one! It's another one! Yo! There it is! Let's go! It was here! Screw you, Galleon. I'm seeing- I'm talking to my dude. Oh my god, we finally found everything. The dead can't make use of wealth in any case. What would they spend it on? Yes, a big brood like that. They need food and shelter and toys. Keep some for yourself. Well, I think you deserve it, yes. I do think I deserve this. Let's freaking go. Give me this too, whatever that is. Okay. So now we got three. The fourth one is literally just a bench warp. It's right here. What's up, Dad? Thanks for the refill. What was called a hero in its moment may be called something very different after a time has passed. The crimes and triumphs of our predecessors echo all around us, don't they? Chains of fate that bind us all together. Do you really want to break them? Yes. I do. I'm gonna break the chains of the room rando. I'm gonna finally be free. Ah! Okay, I didn't take notes on this one. The, uh, the wings room. I don't even remember when I found this, to be honest. Wait, what? 
Oh, door charm shop. That's right next to me, actually. That's right next to me. Wow. Maybe I should have just looked around a bit. Okay, let's go. Well, if things are getting too dangerous down there, maybe it's time to take a break. Come back up and spend some time hunting or gathering or wandering aimlessly. No, not too much longer now. Thank you, Mr. Mushroom. Your words are so meaningful to me. All right, two remain, six, and then King's Pass. And then we can ascend to Mr. Mushroom. Now, I wrote down a path. I don't even need to look at the path I wrote down because I remember it. It's Atrium, left through the three white palace rooms. Oh wait, is it up here? Here. And then right. Because I like just did this path recently. Ah! I've gone through this exact path like four times at this point. Why do you pogo the guy? It's too tempting. Down left here. Let's go. I haven't seen her, no. I'm sure you'll remember where you left her eventually. Trust the moon or yourself, or trust her. You need to trust something, that's my point. Hmm? No, not him. No, absolutely not. You're talking about Rain World? <laughs> All right, one more. We gotta find King's Pass. I am trying to remember where King's Pass was, just off the top of my head. I feel like I was there recently. Um. Oh, where was that though? I want to see if I can find the last location myself. Was that over here? Uh, maybe not. And I'm pretty sure I know where Black Egg Temple is, or at least generally where it is. I'm pretty sure it was near... Oh wait, no! King's Pass is near Grey Mourner. Right? Or are they both near Grey Mourner? I thought Black Egg Temple was near here. This is right next to King's Pass. We found it immediately. But I feel like the Black Egg Temple was also near here, unless I'm wrong. Alright, it's time for Ascend. It's time for Ascension. It's not by tools that you'll triumph. It's through your smarts, your speed, your determination, and your mapping tools. Oh, I see. So you've been following me around then. I hope my travels haven't confused your own, distracted you. Uh, well, my travels have confused me enough, so don't worry. Then again, a meandered journey is, still has meaning. It is, after all, from a journey we find our purpose. Though a stop is more than just a stop. In my if those stops can't be lovely things, wouldn't you say? Transcendent plateaus, distant sandy lands, vast ancient kingdoms. Yours was not the first, nor will it be the last. But it's a unique and special thing nonetheless. And with my duties here finished, it's time I made graceful departure. 
It's time I made grateful departure. Till next time, my friend. Tis a long road we tread, but a joyous one. Goodbye, Mr. Mushroom. Until our paths cross again. See you in Silk Song. All right, now we just need to find the Black Egg Temple. Now we found this pretty early on. I remember being like, oh, it's near this bench. Remember this bench. I don't remember the bench. I, I thought it was this one, but this one was the King's Pass bench. But what bench was it? I feel like I've been going to every bench recently. It was near, I know it was near a bench. It wasn't that far. Damn it, How, why can't I remember? Oro. Oro bench. It's inside Oro. It's inside Oro. I literally remembered. Let's go. Chat remembered too, but I, I actually thought of that on my own. My brain. The Black Egg Temple was inside Oro. Oro's hut. Not inside Oro. Unless Oro ate a black egg at some point. Alright. We actually did it. Let's go. And we got the true ending too. We're overachieving. True ending plus Mr. Mushroom room rando. Just gotta do one boss. Or, you know, boss and a half. Alright, chat. We gotta do the, uh... Wait. What's this? Okay. Oh! <laughs> well, see ya. Bye, lifeblood. We gotta do... Charm build. Chat charm build. So I'm gonna unemote only the, the chat. And the first... Uh, charms that I can put on, I'm gonna put on. Including over charming. All right. Release the chat. Spore shroom. Well, that's fitting actually. It's good that we keep that on for the end. Slug. Dream shield. It, see, it, it always gets picked. It's free. <laughs> it's free, so I guess. That's fine. Strength, womb. Wow, I can fit a lot of these, can't I? Joni. And I don't get to overturn because... Well, the next one is shaman, so I'm going to overturn shamans. Wait, that didn't help. <laughs> Compass is next. We'll overturn. Dude, seriously. Here, I'll rearrange. Can I rearrange? No, I can't. I'll just do... I'll do what I, it was going to end up as. It's fine, we don't need to overturn. Oh my gosh, I have little cute cloud guys. <laughs> Hello, friends. I didn't know there was custom art. Cloud friends, attack! I need Void Heart. Do you? Do you need to equip it? Guess we'll find out. 
Yes? <laughs> Wait, really? I didn't know that. I mean, you obviously can't normally unequip it. But I didn't think unequipping it in rando would affect the ending. No, I don't. Peace. I don't need Void Heart. I don't need to tame the Void. I got my Cloud friends. We're gonna fight the sun together. much to worry about here. I kind of have like every spell. Even this shoddy charm build isn't terrible. Also this boss is just easy. TBH. Do you have a time to talk about, uh... I don't know. I can't think of a funny joke. Hold on. Hold off a bit. I'm trying to think of, like, a one-liner. Or something. Mushrooms? I, I've been trying to think of some way to work in Mr. Mushroom to it. Hold on. Uh, this is some fun jump rope we're playing right now. <laughs> Have you heard about our savior, Mr. Mushroom? I'm here to tell you about the great Mr. Mushroom. We must follow his teachings. They may seem convoluted, but they are necessary for the future of hollow nests. That was rude. You know what? I'm just going to smack you. There it is. Mr. Mushroom Room Rando is complete. That was not as bad as God Home Ending, but it was still pretty bad to find that last <laughs> that last room. That took a while. I had some fun though. Alright, we gotta watch the endings here so we can see Mr. Mushroom. almost skipped, <laughs> like, out of muscle memory. Every boss besides Galleon? Maybe. I think I skipped another Dream Warrior. Like, I don't think I did Noise. <clears throat> I 
don't think I did fluke marm either. Did I ever find fluke marm? Recent items, two lifeblood masks, hollowness, seal, soul refill, sending dark. Where's the guy? Where's the man? Wait, what? Where's the guy? Is it after the credits? Oh, I thought it was before the credits. Wait, is Rando going to mess with it? Hopefully not. Right, it's the post credit surprise uh, tie-in to the, the Hollow Knight, um, you know, cinematic universe. <laughs> we, we have to wait a pretty long time to see Mr. Mushroom show up. It'll, it'll be worth HKCU. One Suica run? I'm probably just going to play Suica after. How's my day been? Normal. I don't really do a whole lot before stream, but I had lunch, <laughs> I guess. It was all right. the last three hours was looking for Kellyan like the whole time I had some red herrings so I'm like oh we can we have to find elevator pass and it was actually completely pointless so basically the whole time apart from the last little bit where I was just quickly getting the last things I needed that's just how room rando goes though there's like one room you can't find sometimes I mean, there's still a few rooms I never found. It could have easily have been the last room I found. All right, is the man here? The man of the hour? Let's go! There he is! Mr. Mushroom! That's what we that's what we've been working for this whole time. To be continued. Dude, I can't believe Hollow Knight ends on a cliffhanger. Alright, <laughs> there it is. Nice. I like the sixteen seconds in God Home. Two seventeen out of two ninety find items. Tran transitions eight forty eight out of eight eighty four. There was still a few, but I got most of them. I spent more time facing left than right, but only barely. Nine deaths. Skill timeline. 30 minutes to claw. Two hours to Vengeful Spirit. Cloak was three hours in.
Cut 1163 grass. And yeah, sub eight hours. That wasn't even that long of a run, really. I got pretty lucky with some things. That was fun, though. Different way to do a room rando. Turned out pretty well. And yeah, I hope everyone enjoyed. I don't know if I'll do another <laughs> room rando anytime soon, but... Probably gonna keep doing just randos every now and then, because people want to see them. I think I might do like a steel... some kind of steel soul idea next, perhaps. We'll see. Co-op? Yeah, I've never really done a co-op one. Apart from... I think we did some multiplayer mod room randos back... Probably like a couple years ago at this point. Also, your cat, thanks for all the biddies. Alright. Well, that ends the rando for today. I'm going to keep streaming. I'm going to play some uh, Suica for a bit, I think. My true stream game. My mainstream game. But yeah, hope everyone had a good time. See ya.